Good morning, it's Julia Jones here and I have the absolute privilege of hosting the New Zealand Farmers page this week. Now you're probably thinking you're not a bloody farmer and you'd be bloody right, I'm not. But I do live on 10 acres, well just under 10 acres in Eureka. I have worked in and around the farming sector, well pretty much in it for over 20 years now. And through the week I'm going to hopefully give some insight into why I think or say some of the things that I do. Now, I don't expect people to agree with me. I, I don't think that's healthy for us all to agree. Um, I don't expect people to all of a sudden go, oh, that's wonderful why you think that. It's just some insight. It's just a little bit of, um, I guess, insight into why I think, feel and say where my beliefs sit. So look, but first the exciting thing is I'll introduce you to the animals, which you kind of already know. So there's Otis and Brian standing over there. We've got... Somewhere in here, Tigger over there, and Falcon somewhere in there as well. And then we've got the lovely land shark who is currently sulking and has put himself in with the um, western horses, which I don't know why because they live on zero grass. So he'll be back with us shortly, I suspect. In the background there, you'll see that beautiful maze. I am so fortunate to be surrounded um, by loads of farms. Um, this maze is just, there's about, I think there's about 16 hectares of it behind me. Uh, the farmers are beautiful, um, we connect really well, they're lovely to me, they probably think I'm nuts, which I am, very, very astute of them, um, but there's something beautiful about having that maze growing around, and I think it's the different contour, every week I get to see a different contour, um, when they take it out and it will go into grass, again, you get to see these beautiful contours, it's just like constant changing scenery, um, I feel very fortunate. Um, I live in, on Morrinsville Road, I'm not sure if I just said that, and as you can hear traffic going past now so if you've ever driven through um, you would have driven past my property I also have a rental property um, at the front there a big house that I rent out and I live in a 50 square meter cottage because that's really all I need um, I do get somewhat overwhelmed at times here I love exactly what I do I'm not great at what I do um, no, I mean I'm good at my job not great at actually doing stuff on farms and um, but I look after this property on my own and I work really hard to learn things YouTube is my best friend um, I'm slowly learning water my fencing's a bit dodgy so I'm certainly not going to take you any closer to that because I did that myself um, but I'm very very blessed to be able to be here and very blessed to be part of the agricultural sector um, I'm incredibly passionate about it I'm on the meet the need board hence why I'm wearing the hat today and I work for the New Zealand Stock Exchange as the head of insights and part of that is actually well is very much looking at the dairy sector but I also look beyond the dairy sector um, within ag and also outside of ag um, one of the things that I'm looking at at the while. I'll go into that later in the week because I'm going to bore you all right now. But look, good morning. Welcome to Monday. Um, if there's anything you want me to talk about, not talk about, um, or even go into, or you want to learn more about anything, please just yell out. Have a fabulous Monday, and thanks again for the opportunity to for me to host this page.